Greetings, Kobe customer. If you need help installing your Kobe wall mount range hood, just watch this quick video to give you some pointers. We'll be using the RA38 SQB hyphen WM hyphen one series as a sample. Before installing, make sure to read the quick reference guide provided in the package. The first step is to test the hood by temporarily wiring it to see if it's properly working. Remember to turn off the circuit breaker first before doing this. Then turn it back on once the hood is wired. If you run into any problems, contact Kobe Range Hoods. As a preparation before the hood installation, you will need to decide the location of the venting pipe. A straight short vent run will allow the hood to perform more efficiently. Try to avoid elbows on long runs as much as possible because these may reduce the range hood performance. But if an elbow is necessary, allow a 12 inch run before doing so. Next, make sure that there is enough clearance between the countertop and the bottom of the range hood. For wall mount style, Kobe generally recommends 26 inches minimum to 30 inches maximum clearance. But do double check your Kobe product manual as some models may vary. Before attaching the hood, check the product manual to see the measurements of the hood. You will need to place mounting screws on the wall, leaving about 1 8 of an inch between the wall and the end point of the screws since this is where you will hang your hood. As an optional step, the hood mounting brackets may be adjusted for different preferred height of the mounting bracket. To install the range hood, align the hood mounting bracket to the screws on the wall and hook the hood into place. Then tighten the screws to secure the hood to the wall. Next, the wires have to be connected, but before connecting the wires, switch the power off at the service panel to prevent accidents. Connect the three wires together and cap with wire connectors. Then, turn back on the power at the service panel. For the ductwork, use a steel pipe and connect it to the hood exhaust and secure the joint with duct tape, making sure that it is completely airtight. Place the outer and inner duct covers. Then position the duct cover mounting bracket at the highest point where the inner duct cover will extend to. Attach and secure the bracket onto the wall. Extend the inner duct cover all the way to the duct cover mounting bracket and fasten screws to secure the inner duct cover. You can then secure the outer duct cover onto the hood body from inside the hood. Lastly, install the baffle filters and make sure that they are properly in place. You may now enjoy cooking with your new Kobe range hood. Thank you for watching. For more information, visit our website at www.kobyrangehoods.com.